see um full moon reading for the hair sign people this is for the Aquarians Gemini and Libra so welcome to the full moon reading of the month of November I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back and as usual remember um that this is the general um, energy so for you air sign and for the extended readings you can pick that up on on demand now this reading is from the 15th of November to the 15th of December so um, be aware and aligned with these energies we're first going to start with the Sun people and then we're going to be looking at the moon people and then we're going to be looking at the central energy which is going to be affecting both the Sun and the moon people and the outcomes the Capricorns that are going to be here to help okay so let's see what is going on so um, we have the energy of the Sun people you're going to be receiving a help from the Capricorns but also um, Neptune your psychic is going to be very high so for you air sign people in the month of November your psychic is going to be very very high because what is happening is that Neptune is the unseen world is going to be coming in with Capricorn Capricorn is the spiritual aspect of yourself some of you um, can ask your guides and angels to go with you um, to um, uh, Neptune to receive information because Neptune is the navel the star of this universe so what you can do is call upon your angels and guides and ask them to align you and guide you um, to Neptune your psychic is going to be up your intuition is going to be up and here it is for the Sun sign people you're going to be working with Saturn it's all about releasing what no longer serving you and bringing you back something in that place okay so um, the Sun people could be realizing um, that there is a situation that is coming up with Saturn where something is about to leave your life now when this energy comes in that something is about to um, leave your life this is a situation where you're going to be finding yourself that something is leaving and your intuition is going to be guiding you because Uranus and Saturn is here and for some of you Aquarians Uranus is your planet and it is here to help the moon sign people but first with the Sun sign people something is going to be um, removed out of your life the energy of the heart is here this is a wonderful positive energy because it coincide with the Sun and with Capricorn so this is going to be good because um, you guys who were born um, 12 a.m. till 6 p.m. you are going to be um, supported by the Capricorns and the earth sign you're going to be having stability in your life so this is this is actually wonderful this is good because what is here what is transpiring is that uh, there is a lot of situation that is going to be coming in as we look at the moon people we have the energy of Uranus you're also receiving an effect of things um, that no longer serve you will be um, coming out of your life and we have here the ear sign people who are going to be helping you because the Capricorns are very very spiritual so they are going to be coming in and basically helping you um, to release certain aspects and certain things that no longer serve now we have the energy of the um, the the Virgos the Virgos are here so some of you who are in relationship with Virgos they could be aligning you with your intuition they could be moving you forward with your intuition and this is um, basically it's going to be very good so I'm really liking um, your energies right there because what is happening and what is transpiring is that you are seeing um, that some real positive situation is about to land you um, because you're going to be releasing um, things that no longer serve you. As you look at the energy with um, um, Saturn, Neptune, and um, Uranus, these are just lining up. But when you look here, um, you both are going to be um, supported by the hurt sign people and the hurt is included 
to bring balance and grounding so a lot of you are going to be connecting with the hurt the Sun is here and this is just so beautiful and wonderful so a lot of you are going to be connected with the hurt so we're going to be looking forward and looking out to see any more uh, messages and how is it going to affect affect your chakra system and which one of your chakra system are going to be affected by these energies okay so let's see with the energy of the Sun what is going to be healing self worth you guys are going to be finding a self worth with Saturn bittersweet something is about to leave your life so it's become bittersweet um, then we have um, this is deception um, and um, for the moon people what is going to be happening positive energy abundancy is going to be coming for the moon people Uranus you is going to be teaching you to have faith Uranus is going to be teaching you to have faith gossip um, some Virgos are going to be gossiping okay and the outcomes is a uh, um, fat uh, facility and that is good because it's you going within um, some of you are going to be having some confusion in your life okay some of you um capricorns could be um bringing you or helping you with the confusions that is going to be coming out in your life okay so and um, there you are you're understanding what it is that is transpiring especially um for the sun the the sun people um self-worth you're going to be learning about self-worth okay you guys are going to be focusing learning about self-worth learning about what it is to have self-worth and this is going to be good this is really 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 going to be a good um, moon quarters Saturn is going to be releasing you of things here you have uh, having the bittersweet of accepting that something that you hold on so tightly on is about to lose you're about to lose this thing so by learning self word you're going to be understanding that this thing needs to go you're going to be letting it go and you're going to be moving on with the energy of the hurt it is bringing you in balance to sit and dissipate dissipate is um, finding your true self coming back uh, to source connecting with source and this is going to be good because what it's going to be doing it is going to be basically aligning you and bringing you balance back in your life because some of you have been out of balance okay the yellow is always the sense of you balancing out yourself as we look at the moon people it's going to be good for you guys in this full moon and remember that it is from the 15th of November until um, the 15th of December abundance is going to be coming in for you moon people whatever is happening whatever is transpiring abundance a lot of abundance is going to be coming in with you moon people some of you could be receiving the message via the dream time as you go along okay so as you go along some of you are going to be receiving the message via the dream time and this is going to be good because what it's going to do is basically aligned you with the positive and the good energies that is going to come in now some of you um, Uranus is coming in to teach you about fate to teach you about the spiritual world to balance out something but teaching you about the spiritual world and balancing out a situation that wasn't um, so positive in your life and this is going to be good because you're going to learn to have faith that's what it's all about it's all about learning to have faith and this is going to be good as we look at the Virgos um, some of you are going to be realizing that the Virgos have been um, talking about you whatever the situation is there is discussion the Virgos either are going to be having discussion with you or they are going to be talking um, gossiping with you information is going to be coming out at you and this is coming from the Virgo so whoever the situation is whatever is happening you are going to be seeing that this is going to be transpiring now it as it looks it is going to be a very good full moon whatever the confusion is someone who is a Capricorn is going to be helping you and aligning you to let you be aware of what is transpiring so whatever the confusion is or was someone is going to be a Capricorn is going to be helping you to release this confusion and let you see and understand what exactly is going on in your life and this is going to be very good because what is going to be transpiring is basically you're going to be seeing that the light of the universe is going to be helping you and these 
Capricorns are going to be coming in and helping you um, to realize uh, the situation and where you are in your life at this time and moving you forward okay so this is um, extremely good so as we as you're going to be aligning yourself you're going to be understanding how important it is for you to connect on a positive level okay it is very important for you guys to connect on a positive level because as you do that you are going to be seeing that life is going to be transpiring around you and this is going to be bringing you um, some really positive situations out in your life okay so this is going to be good and uh, what I'm going to do is just going to um, move you guys forward to see um, how it's going to affect some of you okay because this is really the full moon how is it going to set what does it has to do with the self work how is it going to be fed self worth um, with the energy of self worth you're going to be seeing a situation for what it is some of you someone could be living your life that is a Taurus Virgo or um, a Capricorn um, that person could be a father or a boss or um, a grandfather or someone um, could be living your life because Saturn is moving someone it could be uh, moving a person who has been blocking you um, in your life okay let's see what is coming up with the heart uh, sorry <laughs> I need to get these out uh, okay some of you are going to be um, especially you men between the ages of 25 and 40 45 um, balance is going to be coming back in your world balance is going to be really coming back in your world so you men between the ages of 25 and 45 balance is going to be coming back in your world let's see with the energy of abundance what is coming up um, you have the seven of swords be careful some of you because um, your money could be stolen so be careful some of you be careful because your money um, your abundance could be stolen be careful um, look at things we have the three of ones some of you are going to decide to leave whatever is is, is releasing out of your life you're going to be deciding to leave whatever is releasing out of your life okay now let's look we have the energy of Virgo on gossip and it has to do with um, the four of Pentacles your your financial stability there's a lot of gossip with a Virgo and it's all about your financial stability and what you have so be aware of that be aware of that now we have the energy of the seven of ones so we have two seven so whatever is going on the energy is that you are moving on the good part okay you're moving up you're seeing whatever is happening you're moving up you're seeing whatever is happening okay let's do one more thing to see what has been stolen here because someone abundancy um, item is stolen or was stolen and it is going to be coming back to you okay um, whatever the energies was and that block it is uh, um, the TEF whoever was stealing something now you're seeing the truth of what is happening whoever that was stealing something you're seeing the truth of what has been happening okay so I want to say to you guys um, thank you for being here and um, um, please um, support the channel by subscribe and I will speak to you guys next week okay for the rest of the people who wants to stay with us and uh, go to on demand I am about to move over to on demand so um, please like share these videos it is very important people needs to know what is it happening what is coming up for them it is really important um, be aware of your materialistic things that someone is stealing something or trying to get away with something so be aware um, look out to see what is happening and what is transpiring for you guys this is um, very important because the seven of swords comes up so something is happening ladies and gentlemen um, we are going to be moving on to on demand so let's see what is going to be happening let's see what's going to be happening first we are going to be doing um, the general readings to see um, what is um, coming out so for you guys I'm using this deck because I love this deck um, we haven't used it 
in a long time so I'm using this deck so I'm calling up on the angels and guides to show us what is going to be coming out for the air sign people for the school moon um, please direct us to see what is going to be happening for these air sign people for the month of November going in December what is the energies or here for you air sign people okay um, completion there is going to be a completion in some of you lives okay there's going to be completion in some of you lives now be careful because there